Good evening and welcome to our press conference and your questions for Lucian Favre. No, for, no questions? I will wait and if there are no questions then we'll go again. Oliver Miller. Herr Faber, a great first half. The wonder that everyone was speaking about didn't happen, and you did lose in the end. What do you think, um, what kind of psychological effect do you think that will have on the team? Is that a matter of confidence because you played well in phases, or is it just just a success that didn't happen? Well, I think we played a very good first half with nearly six chances on goal, I think. But unfortunately, we did not score a goal. And we wanted to continue to play like that. And then after three, four minutes in the second half, we conceded a goal. We knew that it was very difficult. We had to score five goals. But altogether, we played a good game. In the first um, half, we had a lot of positive things to learn from. We lost 0-1 in the end, but and we didn't um, lose the, um, the match um, t at home today. We, we could have been ahead at half-time, but it just didn't happen. Um, and it and it just just wouldn't happen. It was just impossible to, to achieve. Any more questions? Well, then that is a very short um, press conference. Herr Favre, in the Bundesliga, you're um, first in the Bundesliga. And now you've out of the Champions League. What's your situation, do you think? Yeah, yes, we have to analyze this game for game. We have done what we can do. We have always analyzed every game. Of course, we know that we made um, a few, too, few mistakes, too many, and that we concede unnecessary goals. And lately, we have not been using the, our chances on goal. In the first half, we had six clear chances on goal. In Augsburg, we had a lot of chances on goal. We just didn't score. That's just part of it. And it just wouldn't happen today. I look at it very positive, the way it is. We, there are a lot of positive things we saw. In the first half, there was only one team on the pitch for me. And we have to continue to play like that. Oliver Miller. So this is two questions. You conceded the goal just after the first half. That's not the first time that Borussia Dortmund concedes a goal right after the half time. Is that coincidence or is it a lack of concentration? Second question, Pablo Alcázar has played some great games, scored some great goals, but at the moment he doesn't look all that happy. Does he think too much about things? Um, I can't say that. I can't think. When did we concede a goal early on? Only in Tottenham? When did we concede a, a goal early, early on in the second half? You said that we often conceded a goal early on the half time. I think it was also the case in a few other few games. So which games? You can't just ask a, a question like that. I'd have to research that again. Well, then you research that, eh? Okay, how about the second part of my... I think I think it was a, a way to Tottenham and then today. And for Paco? Yeah. 
we we had chances on goal that's the most important thing and sooner or later we will score f from our chances on goals and we will try to continue here any further questions yeah first question uh, why didn't Hakimi play today that was a sporting decision um, there's rivalry and competition in every game uh, every team and he didn't play today and there was a second question okay that was all I had okay I'm looking any more questions so if you have another question please no okay I would like to wish you a nice evening and a good journey home. Goodbye. Adieu. Au revoir.